Right, what is going on guys? So I just drove out five hours to North Wales again and we're gonna have a little session. I'm actually planning on fishing mainly tomorrow. It's about two o'clock today. So yeah, I'm just gonna have a session trying to catch anything I can catch. And then tomorrow I'm gonna be uh, just lure fishing and trying to catch wrasse mainly. So yeah, today I've got a, a heavy setup uh, and two spinning rods. So yeah, we'll see what we can catch. I'm guessing dogfish. <laughs> Hopefully there's some uh, mackerel about because I've not really brought much bait with me uh, and I forgot my tripod as well so yeah that's going to make things difficult but it's high tide now so we're going to get rigged up with the bait rod first, get that straight out and uh, yeah, see what we can catch. <sighs> Alright guys so I got my bait rod cast out while I was getting everything else. Uh, well I was before I got my camera set up basically because I wanted to get out ASAP so I'm just going to tighten down on that. I don't expect it's going to take too long to get a bite on that to be fair but yeah just keep my eye on that and I'm going to get casting round with a metal jig see if there's any mackerel pollock or whatever around hopefully there is okay first cast one we're lost <laughs> Two jigs got lost in three casts. I'm gonna set a, a rod up with the uh, leather rass now. Alright, finally rigged up my lighter rod with something to try some rass. Um, yeah, it was kind of annoying. I rigged up a bait, really nice, uh, finesse fillet craw, and then somehow dropped it and spent about 15 minutes trying to find it. So, yeah, that's annoying. So, I've gone for this instead to start with, just to see if I can get a bite. Not even had a bite on that bait rod yet, which is really weird. Let's see, uh, there's any rats about anyway. There's a fish. No, what? There was a fish on that, I swear down. That was so weird. So a fish must have grabbed it, took it to a snag without me realising. It started twitching and I could feel the fish, unless it was a fish was on it anyway and I was just trying to bump a fish off. That was definitely a bite though, that, and that was so weird. Oh yeah, that's, oh, no way. No way, no way, that was a fish. Okay, there is rust there then. This bite's still really off today though. Got that drag a bit tired. Oh, getting bit on the bait rod. Finally. That took a while to get a bite on that, to be fair. Hopefully it's still there. Stop bumping. Okay, at least I know there's fish there that'll bite. That was a really nice bite to be fair, to be fair that. Proper rocking. See if you can feel it. Still there. Got him. Got him. This feels heavy. What the heck's this? Must have gone right into a snag. Oh no, it's coming. This feels really heavy. What the hell have I upped? There's a huss. There might be a bull huss straight off the bat. Feels proper heavy. And it's kiting like a huss. Come on, baby. Just trying to keep it up out of the snags. What we got? Oh, I think it might be a huss. Yeah, it's a huss. I've got a huss first cast. <laughs> yes. That's a pretty nice one as well. That's probably a 10 pounder. That's sweet as freaking bull huss. No doubt no, that's the first fish. Not massive. It's probably a six, seven pounder. But a beast of a fish to start off. Nice little lip hooked. Would have bit me off if it wasn't. Oh man, I'm stoked on that. What a start. All right guys, first cast with the bait rod. Bull huss. Just trying to angle him so you guys can see without biting me. I'll just go straight through these and try to bite you. First fish, bull huss. 
nice one as well to be fair. I just nearly bit me then. And uh, yeah, you don't want your hand in this mouth. Got some real teeth that we just thrown up. Got some nasty teeth. Okay, let's get this skeezer back. Been out of the water long enough. It's a very feisty fish. Ah, what a first fish that is. On the uh, squid bait. Ready for off, my guy? <laughs> Look at that. Looks so cool in that clear water. Yeah, full host. Not the most impressive fish ever, but first one today on bait. I'll take that. See what it's thrown up actually. See what they've been eating. Um, that looks like a, an enemy. Was it a puffer fish or something? I don't know. I have no idea what that is that it's thrown up, but I'll get back in the sea. <laughs> first fish out of the way, stoked. Trying to get a rest now. Get this straight back out there. Because if there's one host feeding, there will be more. It's really quick to uh, set the hook so it doesn't, you know, swallow it and bite me off. Okay, first fish though. Well happy. Like you can tell, the tide stopped running when that's come. Perfect time for a bull off that. Get this pegged back in in my makeshift tripod. Hopefully get another one biting that quick. I'm going to try to stay a bit close to my rod this time. So I'll grab my other rod from over here. First fish though, bull horse. There's a bite. He's come back. Oh! God, let them stun it first and then they come back. It came back for it, but I missed it. Might take it again, that. Drop it right back down. Okay, so I know there's rats here. If there's one, there'll be more as well. Or it's just here again. Come on, come back for it. Just pecked at it. Oh, it did come back for it. Come on. I think my bait's wrecked, yep. Oh, no, I could have hooked that. There's a bite. Oh, missed it. Getting plenty of bites here. I think they're mostly smaller fish though. That's a good fish. There we go. Hooked. That doesn't feel too bad. It's a ras, I think. Or is it? Yeah, it's a ras. There we go. Oh, it's not a big one, but finally got one hooked after all those bites. Ooh, there we go. Fish number two then. Little Balan ras. Well hooked that one anyway. Must have uh, definitely nailed it. Oh, there we go. That's ras. Back where it came from, probably like a 30 centimetre, about a pound. That was on the Pintail Coffee Bleak. LMAB. So yeah, makes a nice little rattle there. I've actually had big 40 plus rats on the 11 centimeter version of this as well. This is a seven centimeter version. I just want to start off with. I'm gonna actually have another cast back down where that was. So I did have a few bites first. So if we get another couple caught. One eternity later. Ooh. Right guys, just changed spots. Literally like two minutes from where I was before. But fresh water, hopefully there's some fish here. The squid's <laughs> the squid's obviously rotten now, it's turned bright pink. Um, which is not great. I mean you still probably get a dogfish on it. But yeah, desperately need to catch some fresh bait. I thought I'd be getting mackerel well easy today, but turns out there's not many about. So yeah, I'm gonna have a few casts around in this new spot. Hopefully there's some here. That one's gone. God damn it. Oh no, she picked it up. Got him. This feels like a hut again. It's not a dogfish anyway. Way too big. This is quite a, quite a big fish, I think. So weird if it is a hut. I've not had a single dogfish today. Uh, no, it's a dogfish. It's just wrapped around. Oh, what the hell? 
Okay, that's uh Oh yeah, it's, it's a very small dogfish, he's managed to get the leader wrapped around him. But it's another fish. Didn't even have a hook in that, it was, it was literally just wrapped in the line. Ow! I forgot how raspy these are. Whew, finally another fish in. <laughs> little LSD. Really little LSD, that barely a pound. It's like the bull hussy's baby, baby cousin, basically. See you, buddy. Let's go there. Got him. Feels like a dogfish. Feels heavy again now. See what we've got. Swimming towards the shore. And staying deep. What is it? What is it? It's a dogfish. Bigger than that last one though at least. Ooh. And he has uh, swallowed that bait as expected. <laughs> okay, four fish. He's just done a poo as well, which is lovely. Okay, there we go, unhooked. Pretty easy that to be fair. Rinse his poop off in. There's fish. Number four, little dogfish. Hey buddy. I knew the dogfish would turn up eventually. Alright guys, that is going to do it for this video. Absolutely rock hard session. Um, four fish, missed a bunch and uh, yeah, don't even know why. Like the conditions are perfect for it. The, yeah, I don't, I don't know what to say. Like, I would have expected at least a load of dogfish or a couple of pollock or something, but it's been so difficult. So, yeah, at least I got that bull horse straight off the bat though. Um, yeah, that's going to do it for this video. I'm going to go sleep in the van and hopefully tomorrow we have a good session of rest fishing. We're going to try some different marks tomorrow. I'm not coming back here because, uh, yeah, they're playing hard to get. So, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed. Something a little bit different anyway. And uh, yeah, I'll catch you in the next video.